In order to change the look and feel of your queries, there are hundreds of personalization and customization options available in BIME's chart configuration options. Let's take a look at a few of these now for our column chart. We could, for example, show grid lines in our query and even stack the columns where you have multiple values selected in your row selector or multiple measures in here. We can modify colors or apply a predefined palette. We can change the way our measures are displayed. We can modify things to do with the X and Y axes, such as changing the title style and the label style, even truncating the X axis labels. In terms of the row selector, we can change the width and all of the colors associated and change the positions selected in the row selector. In terms of the legend, you can change its position and its style. Choose to display your values. Add a shorthand format and change where they are positioned. We can add trend lines, either a constant trend line, linear or polynomial. Decide what filters applied are shown in your query or remove them all like so. We can also have the capacity to offer different visualization types for those looking at your queries. So here we can change from one visualization type to another. The interactions that are available for this query can also be activated and deactivated here. We can choose decompose types, either all attributes, selected attributes, or a specified decompose path. We'll look a bit more at that when we look at the interactivity options in dashboards later on. The drill through, which allows you to uh, show the underlying data, the underlying raw data for a particular data point, we can choose which fields of the data will be exported in that drill through. And you also have the explosion options for when you're using an attribute in this explosions part here. As well as going by the chart configuration options, there are different ways you can modify your, uh, the elements of your query by just clicking on them. So here I can modify the labels in my legend. I can change the y-axis title and the x-axis title too. The configuration options change for the different visualization types that we have available. We'll let you uh, discover these for yourselves.